Yeah. Taylor Swift rolls in. Yeah. She kind of catches eye, eye contact with, I thought, me. But <laughs> Joe swears to this day it was her. This is true. And she goes like this to us. Joanna Gaines and Chip Gaines apparently have trouble remembering that they're celebrities. The former Fixer Upper stars joined Jimmy Fallon on Tuesday's The Tonight Show and recalled the time they didn't realize Taylor Swift seemed to know who they were. Chip and Joe explained how they were at a star-studded event where even A-listers were fanning out over Taylor's presence, so they were caught even more off guard when the singer singled them out, not only making eye contact with them, but also sending a special gesture their way. Taylor walks she in the room. She walks in and the all room the oxygen. goes silent. Yeah. Do you remember? Were you yeah. in the room? And she walks in and all of us just oh, oh, gasp. take a breath in. And, and when she... you're sitting next to the rock and you see him gasp about this amazing <laughs> I mean... creature, we were just like, who in the world? Who who came in? We weren't even paying attention. Yeah. Taylor Swift rolls in. Yeah. She kind of catches eye, eye contact with, I thought, me. But <laughs> Joe swears to this day it was her. This is true. And she goes like this to us. But we both thought it's for sure someone behind us. So, so both Joe and of I us going like this. looking <laughs> over, <laughs> over our shoulders like wondering idiots. who in the world is <laughs> she talking to? And I was like, to? me? The couple may not have expected even an indirect shout out from Taylor, but that didn't stop them from rubbing elbows with other stars. In fact, Chip admitted that he wasn't afraid to be a little more forward when encountering another celeb that night. I here. flirted with Martha Stewart in an aggressive, in a yeah, very yeah. real yeah. way. Um, way yeah. yes. but, I so told her, us... quote, if anything ever happens to oh, Joe, gosh. you better, you better, <laughs> no, you you better watch your DMs. Hey, hey, come on, come on. You That's got true. 20 it's years now in May. That's May. That's 20. Martha likely won't be hearing from Chip anytime soon. He and Joe are set to celebrate 20 years of marriage this year and seem more head over heels than ever. A lot has changed for the former HGTV stars in the past two decades, but their love for each other has stood the test of time. Ahead of launching their Magnolia Network in 2021, the pair told Access Hollywood's Kit Hoover that despite their share of challenging times, divorce is simply not an option. One thing that I would say is our superpower is that Joe and I are not quitters. I mean, throwing in the towel is is not something that honestly ever even comes to mind. And I would say that that happened pretty early, or early in our relationship where we just thought it's interesting that divorce or leaving one another is not really an option for us. And so somehow that little, that little foundation has definitely served us well because things have definitely been challenging. We're not perfect and, and we have issues and trials and errors just like anybody. But, but I would say that it's funny when you say throwing in the towel in fairness, I would admit if we had considered that along the way, but, but relationally we're in it for, for forever. You know, it'll never not, this'll never be a gossip mag that we don't make it. That's how it ends, and I can kind of see the end of that story. And then when I think about difficult things that we've done, and I would say the the real estate crisis of kind of like 2006, 7, 8, 9, 10, you know, it didn't hit Waco till a little bit later. So it's a little bit of an extended period that I'm referring to. But, you know, that crisis, Joe and I had multiple opportunities to quit and throw in the towel, and that was just not in our in our DNA. And so now I think we've taken that and realize that, you know, it's like you can't ever lose if you don't quit. And Joe and I keep showing up day after day. And sometimes it's right, sometimes it's not. But we, uh, but we keep putting one foot in front of the other.